Hello creators! Today we're going to look at how you can fade out audio or music in your Movavi Video Editor Plus 2020 or 2021. I've already imported some songs and a video that has audio on it here. If you have your music down on the audio track or any other type of audio, then there's a couple different ways you can fade it in or out. The most simple way to do it is to go to the clip properties. So we're going to double click the video and then we're going to go up here to fade in or fade out. So if you choose fade in, you can choose the amount of time it will fade in. So point it goes in increments of a half second. So I can do a half second fade in, half sec or an, a, a full second, all the way up to 10 seconds. And then if you change this, you can't make it any bigger than 10 seconds. And you can see that it's faded it in here and it's gonna fade it in at the beginning. So if I wanna fade it out, I'm gonna do the same thing here with the fade out. Now with this one, you can see that there's not any sound really at the end of the clip. So the fade in won't really make a difference unless I cut the clip to this point, or the fade out won't make a difference unless I cut the clip to that point. And then I can do my fade out and you can see it will start to fade the audio there, down there. So the other way is to use audio points. And to add an audio point, you can double click this line and it will add audio points, which you can then drag up or down. So I can drag this one down so that it will fade out at the end. This makes it a little easier to see it with your video. So I like to use this a lot because I can see exactly where it is on my video and fade it out. You can do this at the beginning or anywhere on the audio clip. Now, if you're having a hard time double clicking the line, you can also right click and add volume point. Or if you've got a mess of it, you can reset all your volume points at that point. Now, if I have music on a video, so you can see it's attached to the video there. I'm gonna go ahead and delete this one by selecting it and using the delete key. So if I use the fade in or out on the whole clip, like with the video and the audio, then it's gonna fade in the video as well. So if you don't want that, you can disconnect your audio here, or you can use those audio points we talked about earlier. So if I do this and create a volume point there and then lower the last volume point, then it's not going to fade out the video. It will just fade out the audio there. With the volume points, you can also fade it in or out in the middle of a clip. So I can have this part fade out for maybe a section where I'm talking or where something's happening, or I can even fade it just enough so that it's in the background and maybe you can hear me speaking clearer or hear something that's happening in the video or whatever audio you have aside from your music and make that stand out a little more. I also will do the opposite for a moment, maybe where I stop talking and I want the music to fill in that kind of blank spot. So then I would use the volume points like this. So I just reset them all so that I have something fresh to work with. So maybe I have the whole clip a little lower, but for maybe a part where I talk, I'm gonna create four volume points or where I'm not talking and it's quiet and I just want them to be able to like have that still some sound going on. So I'll up the music and then lower it back down when you start talking again. So there's several different ways to fade your audio or music in Movavi Video Editor. Um, it's a pretty simple technique, but very, very useful. Be sure to like and subscribe if this helped you out, and we'll see you in the next video.